So the question arose as to how you can copy keyframes from one object to the other. So to do that I'm going to just load Messiah up as its default state and make a tiny little animation of the camera moving up and down. So just scrub to where I want it and the camera moves up and down. Now you'll note if I open this up and I look at the Y position, you note that it goes up and down. On the X position, there's nothing going on. There are no keyframes there, just these little plus marks to, that indicate on another channel in the object there is a keyframe, but there is no keyframes on the X position. That's because here it is set to the top level by default independent channel. And that's great for things like machinery and sometimes camera motion is a lot easier to work with independent channel mode. And so to show you how that works, I'm going to create another object in my scene, a null object. And then back in Animate, I'm going to select all the keyframes from the camera, left click on Copy, go to the null, go to my Y position, Y channel on my null, and left click on paste and you'll note that the um, keyframes of the Y position on the camera have copied to the keyframes of the Y position of the null. So what you normally want is to copy everything over. And so that's when you switch over from independent channels to all channels. So now if I were to go to the camera and create keyframes now on Y and another one here. You'll note that when I switch to X there are actually keyframes there and I'll even move it a little bit just to make sure that you can see that there are keyframes. So now we need to copy that and paste those keyframes over onto the null. So just like before we left click, pick copy, go to the null uh, we'll delete all these keyframes and click paste and now the null will be perfectly positioned on top of the camera because we copied all channels of the keyframe of the camera and placed them on the null. So that's how you copy and paste keyframes from one object to the next.